I'm going to show you start to finish how easy it is to install WM Recorder 14 and get it up and running to start recording right now. So I've got the uh, first screen of the installation process in front of me. I'm just going to click next and next again. I agree with the terms and conditions. Next again. That's fine to install it in that folder. And I click start. So it's been successfully installed. I click exit. Do I want to run WMRXE? I click yes. It's now going to set up the recording modes. So I click OK. So it's now going to install the adapter monitor. I'm not really sure what that means, but I'll click next. So it's telling me that WinPCAP is installing, but then it says, wait, uh, it's already installed. If you want to force it, I don't. So I'm just going to click Cancel. Click Next to start checking your network adapters. So it's all set. Click Finish. And I'm in demo mode, so it's asking for my registration code, but I'm just going to click continue in demo mode. Brings up the WM Recorder welcome page. And actually on the page are three sites that you can test the program with right away. I'll just go to Justin TV and click on one of the live channels. How about entertainment? And I'll go to the random. And as soon as it starts playing, WM Recorder starts connecting to the stream. Looks like an episode of House. And it's recording. And why don't I minimize the screen and then right click on this uh, recording of house from Justin TV and go to preview recorded file and it brings up the appliant FLV player. Let me just see if I can scroll it over for you. And there it is. Beautiful. And I can even fast forward through it. And that is all there is to it from start to finish. I, you have seen me install the program and record a uh, file, and it's still recording up here. So uh, go to it. Have some fun. Enjoy uh, playing around with it. It's a really fun program to use. It's WM Recorder 14. Bye-bye.